Hello everyone, this is Rick Grantham of Small Business Champion Bundle. This week we're going to walk you through a product profitability template. Now how do you know of everything that you sell, which of the products are more profitable and which ones aren't? So we're going to walk you through that, that's coming up next. Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Rick Grantham of Small Business Champion Bundle. Uh, this week we're going to walk you through a product profitability analysis template. So there's a few things you have to consider whenever you're determining the profitability, not necessarily of your company, but of each of the individual line items that you're selling. Now, although the template we're going to show you is designed for products, you can very well replace that with services as well. So this could be leverage you know, for products or services. So first off, there's a few things to consider as you're determining profitability. Of course, you not only need things like the price and the cost, the unit cost and the number of sales, but all of this is really to determine things like your revenues, your cost of goods sold, your profit and loss, and all of that. So you'll also need to take into consideration things like marketing cost, sales cost. So are you going to continue to put large marketing costs and large sales into something you might have a very low margin on? Certainly that wouldn't be a wise idea because you may go negative as a result. So this allows you to compare all of your products side by side by side, taking into account the marketing, taking into account the sales, taking into account your margins and all of that. And again, you could also do this with services. So stay tuned for the next product tutorial where we're gonna bring up a template. We're gonna show you how to input your products, your services, and that's all coming up next. So stay tuned, stay tuned for the template portion. That's coming up next. Hello everyone, this is Rick Grantham of Small Business Champion Bundle. Welcome back to the, uh, to the template portion of the tutorial. Whenever you first pull up the template, the first thing you'll be met with is the title page. We'll just skip right past that. Assume you know how to click on you know, the download books and things like that. Let's get straight to the template. So to get to the template, you come down here to the bottom where it says Product Profitability in one of the tabs, you'll click on that, Product Profitability. Now when you do this, you'll be met with the template. First off, if you scroll over here to the right, we're not going to spend any time on it, but there's explanations and instructions and everything like that. So as you come over here to the left-hand side, what you'll see is uh, two graphs, the two graphs related to cost of goods sold and your unit sales. And you'll see here along each axis are your product names, product one through, in this case, product 12, uh, product one through product 12 on unit sales as well. And you'll see that correlates to the products which are down here, products one through 12. But you're not limited to 12 products or 12 services. You could just come in on the next line item here if you wanted to and type in uh, product 13. Click there and you'll see all of the format and everything updated. And you'll see now you have 13 products here. We just don't have any information in here yet. So there's a number of things here from price to unit cost, etc. But first let's highlight the things that you input your own numbers for and where the calculations are. How you do that is you'll scroll over to the right hand side. You'll see there's a section that says highlight inputs and there's a drop down menu here. It's currently selected as no. Uh, with the drop down menu and select yes. And whenever we do that, uh, the items where you can put in your own information, your own product information is highlighted. So you see for product one, product two, and we'll just use product 13, which we just put in as an example. And let's say these are, um, let's say we're selling shoes. See, now shoes shows up as one of our products, shoes up here. And the price, let's say those are $50. The unit cost, let's say we get them for uh, $25. And the number that we sell, we'll say we sold 500 of them. So what happened is, your revenues, your cost of goods sold, and your gross contributions have already automatically updated. So here we can now put in our marketing costs, particularly if you're able to, uh, if you have marketing costs associated with the promotion of that product, go ahead and put that in here as well. We'll say the product promotion was, uh, we'll say $4,000. Additional sales cost uh, of you know, employees who might be pushing the product. Or, or any other kind of sales cost, and we'll say in this case that's $1,000. And so now your gross margins and your profit and loss and everything are all updated as well. And so you have shoes updated in your product information. So really all you need here is the name of your products or services, which you could have put in here just as easily. 
uh, your price, your unit cost, your unit sales, and any sort of marketing or sales cost. So you see this is very straightforward. It's a very easy way to include your marketing cost, include your sales cost, and compare side by side each one of your products or each one of your services to figure out what makes the most sense and what is the wisest place for you to put your marketing and your sales dollars. So that's it. This is Rick Grantham of the Small Business Champion Bundle. We're talking about product profitability template. I'd like to invite you to go ahead and subscribe right about now underneath me. There should be a subscribe button. Feel free to go ahead and click there. There's plenty of templates that we put out and just sound business advice really for the small business owners. Go ahead and subscribe. We put out these videos on a regular basis. You'll also see over on your right hand side over here a number of other templates that we've done and other uh, videos that we've done. Feel free to click on those as well. So until next time, this is Rick Grantham, Small Business Champion Bundle. Thank you.